thank uh, the FIBA for the opportunity that I can uh, present uh, uh, some of my uh, ideas. Um, I'm coming from uh, uh, different sport. Uh, I was asked to to present uh, like our experiences with uh, developing players uh, regarding the the contact skills or contact in general. Uh, I think it's a um, very important uh, theme for uh, all of the sports and especially collective sports because uh, as we see the evolution of um, all of the collective sports so it's towards uh, uh, more strength, more power, especially power or quick speed and quickness. Uh, not only quickness of running but quickness of uh, everything and speed of everything. Um, but for me, the, to develop the players regarding the, the, the contact skills, it's not only about uh, the physical aspects, it's more uh, about the, the mental, mental aspects and the coordination aspects as well. So it's why I think um, uh, this theme is very important to, uh, to incorporate uh, into the training of uh, youth, even children, not only to develop really uh, high performance athletes, but as well regarding the prophylaxis. It means um, a prevention against uh, some injuries. Uh, before I start my presentation, uh, I think it would be, uh, uh, it would be uh, quite good uh, to present myself. So my name is uh, Martin Kafka. Uh, I'm coming from a different sport, from uh, rugby. <coughs> um, in my playing career, I played uh, abroad as well. I played in uh, Spain, France and Japan. Then I uh, finished my studies with uh, a professional license in, in France, one of the biggest uh, rugby countries. And then I came back here to, uh, to try to help uh, the, the Czech rugby uh, to grow. Uh, now uh, I'm not involved uh, in the Czech rugby because some different uh, reasons. But anyway, uh, it's, uh, it's about me, it's, it's not about me, it's about uh, the theme. Um, I will start with a short presentation, just only to, to explain you a little bit what you will see, maybe I hope, uh, what you will see on, on the pitch. Uh, so the majority of the time I would like to spend with uh, showing some, uh, uh, some exercises and the training tips and etc. etc how to develop all the players uh, together. <clears throat> if you can see that, uh, can you really see uh, what, what is written there or because, because of the sun shines a little bit? So I hope you can, you can see a little bit. Uh, <clears throat> the, the, the most important thing is to, is to be able to predict or to anticipate the evolution of the game. Because when you are preparing your players, I, I suppose that uh, you are coaching, training uh, young players. So when you are coaching young players, for example, 10 years old, so you have to be preparing them for the, so we are speaking about, about the basket, so you have to be able to, to prepare them for the basket in 10 or 15 years that will be played, because now the children, they are 10 years old, but they will be performing if, if they succeed when they are 20, 24 and more. And if we prepare them uh, for the basket of today, so in 10 years' time, uh, you will be like uh, 10 years in, uh, in retard, a little bit. You know? So, so it's, not, it's not easy to predict, to anticipate, but it's based on a lot of studies, on your experiences, on sharing a lot of information. So this is very important thing that you share the, the, your experiences, your know-how with other coaches because it helps all of you, not only to, uh, to the others. And as well, it's very important to speak with your federation because they have uh, professional uh, people. They, they are occupied by, this, uh, by, by these things. So now you can, you can know how the sport can be, uh, can be evolved in 10, 15 years always any anticipation so you can fail but we don't have any any other option uh, if we see 
the sport of today, the collective sport of today, so we can see that this uh, like a really uh, sh uh, narrow link between uh, between the mind and the body. It's not only about about the, the the physical things, but as well the the mind things. So if we speak about the body, so it means skills, abilities, posture. That I will be speak about a lot about the posture. So we are. Now we are in the theme of prophylaxis and as well about the high performance of the athletes. And mind, like gnostic processes and cognitive processes. What, what it means, I will explain a little bit later, but it means tactics in general. Uh, and as well alternation of different focuses uh, of body and mind. Very important, especially in, in the sport, in the, in the sports that uh, uh, some contact is uh, incorporated in uh, in all of the sports, ball sports or collective sports. Some kind of contact is incorporated. It's that's an evolution of uh, of any sport as well. Uh, but it's not only about the contact. It's as well about uh, using more speed, using more power. Uh, so in in all these aspects, it's very important to. Uh, can you see the the uh, the red light? So, so you can. See it's very important for the player to be able to alternate between high and low mental activation, attention and concentration, and technique and tactics. So, what does it mean? High and low mental activation. Uh, if I if I need to do some technical uh, tactical choices or like fine motoric. Um, uh, skills, so I need to be a uh, little bit low in, in the met mental activation. Uh, in, in the opposite uh, way, if I need to use my, my strength, my power, my speed, maximum speed, or if there is a contact, so I need the, the maximum level, the high uh, mental activation. Why? The nature was created us for this to survive. So when I'm activated on the, my maximum uh, level of the activation. I really, my body is prepared uh, to give the maximum strength, power, and speed, or even to be able to uh, to survive in the contact. But if you see the analysis of uh, of the collective sports, in the collective sports there are a lot of actions like uh, decision making, like a fine motor skills and as well contact, speed, power and the players they have to be able uh, to be alternating all the time this kind of level of mental activation. Very important things. Um, I would give you an example from my sport from rugby. Uh, there is a lot of contact so you can imagine that the, 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 the average uh, mental activation is higher maybe that in maybe in your sport but if you see that some of the players, uh, um, sometimes they, they need glasses uh, to see well. So, but during the game, they, they are not using the glasses. They have uh, different things. But when they lose it, so imagine how, how difficult it is to be prepared for, for a rugby game, to survive, and then to be sitting here and trying to move the, uh, the, the finger towards uh, the eye and, and place the thing on, in, in your eye. That's for normal people. It's it's nearly impossible, but the rugby players they are able to do it because they are trained for that. So that's just an example. Uh, attention and concentration. Again, what's the difference? Attention. It means that I have to be able to capture a lot of informations before uh, before the decision making process. So I have to be able to uh, uh, to to perceive what's going on on the pitch. So I need the attention. But then, when, when I have decided what to do, and if I'm expecting a contact, if I'm falling down, or if, if I know what I'm, doing to do, what I'm going to do, so then I need a concentration. It means a narrow focus on, on, the, on the, like a narrow thing I'm going to, uh, to do. And the, the ability to go all the time changing or alternating from, from the attention to the concentration, it's very important things. So, 
uh, another example, uh, for example, uh, your team is de defending, and then when when the team gets the ball, you need to switch quickly uh, for the uh, for counter attack. But for for this, you need exp uh, especially this kind of thing to be able to change uh, attention towards concentration, and then again to attention and concentration. Very important thing as well. And technique and tactics. If you train just uh, just technique, if you do like a lot of drills, it's for nothing because because the players they would be able to show a lot of skills, but they they won't know uh, how to use them. Uh, and as well, uh, when you train with the small children or even youth, for them it's difficult to to do like a transfer from the drills towards the real game so the integrated training in my opinion when you when you work with uh, with the children on and youth is uh, is very basic and as well the decisive comp a component of uh, of our sports it's speed i said it's not only about like speed of running but as well it's a it's a playing speed as well body it means power speed but as well the mental state the the speed of decision making uh, etc and the other components as a strength power coordination uh, endurance it's uh, just uh, some components that should support the sport uh, the, the speed so that slide was uh, uh, was super um, uh, important, so it's why maybe I I have spoken a little bit more time about that because it's exactly what what I'm going to try to show you afterwards. Uh, here you can see like some uh, uh, types of speed you need. So as as, as you see, uh, there is a like movement speed, but as well acceleration, deceleration, agility. Uh, maximum speed maintaining in your sport it's not very uh, important but acceleration deceleration and agility uh, it's it's all the time your players are doing and to be to be able to to perform well in this uh, uh, in this area you need the power uh, not only the speed but as well the power so it's why sometimes when I, I think that the, 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 the power and speed, uh, sometimes it's a very similar thing. Uh, very quickly, this is something you know. Uh, it's very uh, classical dividing, uh, nothing, no, nothing special. Just one thing, uh, I think it's very useful to use uh, this picture when you are analyzing the performance of your team or of, of your of your players, but it's not very useful if you use it to prepare your training. You cannot you you cannot prepare your training just okay. So today I'm my focus will be on the technique, or today my focus will be on the strength and conditioning, or psychology or tactics. No, it's uh, it should be integrated. Everything should be integrated. But to do like your your own analysis, it's quite useful. Uh, this is my point of view, um, how, how I uh, uh, divide uh, the domain, uh, gnostic and cognitive uh, functions, it's a very important uh, thing, gnostic functions, it means uh, uh, what I see, what I hear, the balance, so the vestibular system, what, what I feel, or proprioception as well, uh, cognitive functions, it means it's a, it's a, it's a memory, it's decision making, it's a communication, it's orientation in uh, space time, very important for, uh, for, for our players. Uh, if you speak about neuromuscular qualities, so it means uh, strength, power, speed, coordination. So you can see that they are not uh, uh, like, uh, like uh, endurance uh, uh, domain involved because it's quite different. Sometimes when you speak about the physics, so we uh, we speak about like all of these domains. So I think when you when we when we want to focus in different uh, way the 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 training preparation. So from my point of view, uh, 
this kind of um, um, of things being together uh, is quite important. And energetic so uh, sources. So basically, it's endurance. So as you know, we have a uh, aerobic system, an anaerobic system, lactic, alectic, and and as well as I showed um, on the uh, here. Uh, that the speed characteristics in the collective sports it's alternation of short, high intensive and or ex explosive actions and relatively long recuperations. It's, it, it varies uh, according to the sport, but we have to be able we have to be able to be uh, we have to be able to repeat all the all the high intensive actions with the, the with the same intensity, and for that we need. Uh, the energetic sources and posture. Uh, very important things. Um, if you want to move well, you have to start from from a right posture. Uh, and if you if you work on your posture, it means that you work as well on your prophylaxis or prevention against against injuries uh, of of your players. What, what's what's the basic uh, uh, posture? So it means that. Uh, uh, your leg has to be uh, on the widthness of uh, of your shoulders. The the uh, the feet should be uh, not not straight straight, but like in like 30 degrees, as I show. So it's not standing like here to be parallel, but like something about like 30 degrees like this. If you see the the little like like little babies. When they are playing and, and uh, lifting their, their legs, the, the, f the feet are not parallel, never, always like this. Why? Because it's, uh, it's, um, it, it's better for, for, for some anat anatomic uh, uh, reasons of your hips. And as well, uh, when you go down, when you are squatting, so, and th this kind of thing is very important for your players because as I have seen a lot of the basketball players, because your position to defend, etc., is like this. And a lot of, of your players, if you see my knees, uh, and if I'm squatting, so the knees are going uh, uh, like in front, to be in front of the toes. So that's something that can be dangerous. Uh, and more, some of them, uh, they are coming even inside. Okay? So, so in normal life, it doesn't matter maybe, but in, in, a, in, a, in a, uh, repeated trainings, it can cause some problems. For example, in five years, they can finish on the table of a surgery. Okay, so you have to be able as well to see, I know that you, we as a coaches, we are, we are not uh, physiotherapists, uh, but we, we, we need to be able to see, uh, to detect if our players are moving well. If you see something uh, it's, that's wrong, so maybe you can, you can go to, uh, uh, to speak with a the, with the physiotherapist, okay? So as well, when you are uh, squatting, so all the joints should be in one line. Not, for example, like this, or like this, you can see a lot of times, because when the players are doing, for example, a, a change of direction, uh, sidestepping, etc. So, and if step like this, and my knee goes like this, so, so just I'm very n near to the hospital, okay? As well, the back should be straight, the back should be parallel with the, with the tibias as well, and the, the, the shoulder, the shoulders should be higher than, than your hip. Your head should be in the natural position, not in this way, not in that way. So, so these principles, are very important, and as, a, and as well, uh, the plates, uh, scapulas, uh, should be uh, should be a place like this. Uh, in a lot of times, the scapula of the players are getting like that. So afterwards, they should they, they will have problems shooting, catching, etc. So that's something you you have to be able to observe. And why is it so important? Because every movement starts from from your legs. If I want to, if, if you want to jump, because in basketball there's a lot of jumping, so if you want to jump, so it starts from 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 your leg, 
and and as well from your leg is uh, uh, you are you are transferring the power through the th through the body uh, somewhere else for example in 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 the region of the contact okay so so if for example uh, I have to uh, hit another player because there is a contact and uh, my legs are quite well but my body is too inclined so in this way the the the, the vector uh, getting from the legs is going somewhere there but my my back my, the vector is directed over there so it means that here in this in this part of of, of your of your back so uh, there can be like a uh, like a crisis a crucial point and afterwards you can get injured as well uh, regarding the the low back okay so very important things and as well more to be well prepared regarding the core because a lot of times you are uh, battling for the ball in the air if you are in the air and you want to battle uh, for the ball to catch the ball or even uh, to try to uh, uh, to shoot so so you need to uh, to have a support somewhere if I am standing on the ground my support is the ground is, is the floor but if I'm in the air where is my support it's here posture and core okay uh, we are speaking about the uh, the, the prophylaxis uh, so this is some components of uh, uh, of the load I think you you can uh, uh, you can you can know them if we speak about the children so uh, less volume more intensity less density what, what does it mean density it's uh, uh, it's the ratio against uh, the 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 activities and the recovery so and and how how you feel the density how how how, how difficult is it so uh, the density shouldn't be very high but the frequency should be very high the frequency it means how often we are training how often a week we are training uh, uh, when because normally when when you work with your children so so we are uh, there's a l learning process so for that we need to repeat a uh, lot of times skills movement etc etc and the specificity uh, older is getting the player uh, more specific more specificity should be involved in the training so if I'm if I have for example a six-year-old uh, boy or, or, uh, or girl so uh, the movement should be more general not very specific this is some uh, some rules and principles uh, uh, regarding the the loads when when I when, when I was in France so th this is like a mnemotechnic uh, uh, it was like a mnemotechnic um, um, help for me uh, FEPA uh, it means uh, uh, doesn't do uh, frequency we have to be able to manage the frequency uh, regularity it means that uh, it's not about that uh, uh, for example uh, today we are training that kind of skill and then uh, we will repeat it in uh, in one month uh, time so the regularity should be uh, higher intensity time it means uh, volume progressivity alternation specificity we have we have been speaking about alternation it means uh, uh, the recovery or, re or recuperation and uh, and and the the load okay so if if you prepare your training uh, having in in the mind these uh, these things so you should be uh, you should be uh, preparing well your training uh, robotics creativity plasticity a lot of a lot of terms uh, uh, as well the sport is e evolving we need some players uh, we speak about the the creativity I don't think really to be honest I don't think that we need 
uh, creativity in, in the sport. Creativity is something, uh, something different. It's something totally new. Uh, more, uh, we speak about the plasticity, maybe, from, from my point of view. Some of the coaches, uh, as, uh, for example, Michal Ježdík, as you know, Jaroslav Řebík, uh, etc. So, uh, Zdeněk Haník, so they speak about the variability. So it means that, that the players, they have a lot of skills, and not only skills, physical skills, but as well tactic skills, and they are able to, uh, uh, to choose from them on the, on, the, on the right situation, okay, on the present or actual situation. Or recreativity, recreativity it's something I've been uh, thinking about because recreativity, it means that we are using something we already know, but we have to adapt it to the situation uh, uh, we are in. Okay, so, so there are like different small, small, more or less uh, adaptations, but it's always something I know. I know how to do it, I can do it. So it's not really creativity, but in my, in my mind, recreativity. So, uh, so when you are preparing your players, so it's, it's, it's very important to have in mind as well what you, what you want to, uh, how you want to prepare your players. To prepare creative players is different than to prepare uh, players with uh, uh, having uh, a quite um, important variability. Uh, facing the fear, of, of course, uh, uh, when there is a contact, so so they can be they can be um, a fear. They say like in short time, uh, that's nothing uh, uh, nothing in in secret, um, but. In a long uh, time, I would like to uh, to speak about maybe ideo ideomotor training. It means uh, like visualization and imagination. Visualization is very important um, when we learn a new skill, because the players they 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 try uh, to see in 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 their head how the movement should be. And they are learning like this. I in, even they are not doing that skill physically. So, uh, like mentally, uh, uh, they are even learning. So sometimes when you are doing like uh, some relaxing exercises with them, and you are applying uh, some visualization on them, you can see that uh, uh, the muscles they are doing that kind of movement are moving a little bit. What's the difference between the visualization and imagination? Imagination is more about the tactics. Because I can, uh, as, a, as a player, so I imagine the situations I can be in during, the, uh, during a game. So uh, in this kind of thing, I can as well uh, face the, the, the fear. Uh, this is not very well seen. It's just, uh, it's coming from my, uh, from my experience. Uh, you can just uh, read it um, quickly. I won't speak about uh, the, uh, that a lot. But it means, uh, uh, for example, uh, if, if I have to be honest, so this experience I did in, in my sport in, in Czechia, uh, unfortunately, uh, as I see, it's, it's, it's very subjective. So I place the Czech rugby here, uh, sad, but it's like this. So but if, uh, if you want to, all the sports, they, they are evolving sometimes uh, very well, so they are always here. But, uh, okay, uh, do you have some questions now or, if, uh, or just maybe after some, some exercises? If, if I can... Uh, Ask to, to put it a little bit away. Kluci, můžete sem? Tak, vemte si pět balonů. Pět, pět balonů si vemte. Now I'm going to speak a check because just I will I will do like some I will uh, tell them some orders etc what to do so it's uh, quite uh, more easy to speak to them in check uh, I'm not going to say something what I want to 
to tell you just uh, for them to know what to, what to do if if there's uh, important information for you so i will i, I will switch into into the english okay tak kluci pojďte sem tak tady vidíte jeden čtverec ten žlutý jo to je jeden čtverec druhý čtverec tady ten červený ten je nejmenší a pak tam je ten modrý vidíte ten modrý tak když řeknu žlutá žlutá tak musíte všichni do žlutého čtverce. Když řeknu modrý, tak, tak budete muset přeběhnout do modrýho, do červeného a tak dále. Jo? A teď jde o to, že budete, si, budete se pohybovat maximální rychlostí a budete si zároveň nahrávat. Jo? Jakmile řeknu hra, tak si najděte někde balon, jaký, jaký chcete. Vidíte, že tam to si prostě najděte, kde chcete. A budete se snažit dát co nejvíc košů, ale vždycky do, do každého koše můžete vystřelit, dát jenom jeden koš. Jo? A když dáte ten koš a budete střílet do druhého koše, tak to vám potom řeknu. Jo? Tak, připravený? Tak hra. Ale, ale rychle, rychle, a musíte, musíte zůstat pořád ve čtvrci. Nesmíte ze čtvrce ven, nesmíte ze čtvrce ven. A co je rychle, zběhat, běhat, běhat. Koho uvidím stát, tak dostane... Tak, tak jste, šup, co nejrychlej, co nejrychlej, co nejrychlej zběhají, co nejrychlej, balon nesmí na zem, balon nesmí na zem, balon nesmí spadnout na zem, co nejkratší dobu držím balon, co nejkratší dobu balon držím balon, co nejkratší dobu držím balon, co nejkratší dobu nesmí spadnout na zem, komunikujte, mluvte, mluvte, mluvte. Now you can, now you can, uh, you can see that they, they lack of, of communication, it's very important for them, Uh, to speak to themselves because they don't know who has the ball, who is throwing the ball, who is catching the ball. Very important just to communicate. They are not communicating a lot. Ještě rychle, rychle, rychle. Červený, 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 červený. Now, now you can see they, they, they have to orientate themselves in the uh, in the space where the where the square is. That square is. Now they see that the square is uh, smaller. So, so there's more contact. You can see that uh, they react it as uh, the movement is uh, is not it's uh, is not so quick. So, so you have to motivate to be quicker. Rychle, rychle, ne, 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 stát na zemi, ne, ne, stát na zemi. Co je rychle, co je rychle? Přihrávka, přihrávka, přihrávka. Hra. Now the thing is that. Uh, They, they have to try to put uh, uh, more points possible, but always they have to shoot only once to one basket. Then you have to, you have to change, change it. So uh, as well, uh, if you put them in all of the, your pitch your, or your court, if you say, so now they have to, they have to uh, uh, take the measure of the, uh, of, of the pitch they are playing on. Modrej! Modrej, modrej! Modrej, ale přihrávky, přihrávky. Tak, dobrý. Dobrý, stop. So just, uh, just one thing. Uh, it will be just a demonstration, not as a uh, real training uh, should be done, because I will stop it sometimes, use some of the players, etc., etc. So it's not about the, the intensity that the real training should be, okay? Just how, how to incorporate a lot of domains into the trainings. Všichni si vemte balón. Všichni mě basketbalový balón. Všichni máte? Tak, teď budete, bude úplně to samé, ale budete driblovat. Te, teď nebudete si nahrávat, budete jenom, budete jenom driblovat. Jo? Modrý čtverec! Ale rychle, rychle, rychle! Nestojím, 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 nestojím! Co nejrychlej? Kdo bude nejrychlejší? Kdo bude nejrychlejší? Koukám, kdo se pohybuje nejrychlej! Koukám, kdo se pohybuje nejrychlej! Střídám ruce, střídám ruce, koukám, kdo se pohybuje nejrychlej! Žlutej, žlutej, žlutej! Pořád driblu, pořád driblu. Kdo bude nejrychlejší? Červený, červený, červený. A teď jsem zvědavý, kdo bude nejrychlejší. Teď jsem zvědavý. Jeden, pojibuj se, pojibuj se, pojibuj se. Nevadí, že se strazí mě dudá, musím se vyjíbat, musím se vyjíbat. Hra! Hmm. <clears throat> 
Goj. Stop. Tak, pojďte sem. As well, the very important thing, I will, I will show a lot of exercises. It's not right for one training. It's just an inspiration for, uh, for you. Normally, uh, it's much better uh, to have only one exercise, for example, and to go modificating the exercise uh, during the training session, not to have uh, 1,000 of exercises and to show how good training I, uh, coach I am. Because I, I call this kind of coaches uh, YouTube coaches. No, because if you use only one uh, one um, uh, uh, playing situation or um, just one uh, situation, so it means uh, that the players they are not they don't they don't have to focus on the formal things, so where they have to be, etc. But they can focus on the content, and that's important that the players uh, be focused on the content. It's why I, I'm going using the same exercise, but just doing some modifications, okay? So, tak teď budete, budeme dělat úplně to samé. Když budete střílet na koš, tak musíte vystřelit ze sedmimetrový vzdálenosti. To si rozhodnete, jak chcete. Ze sedmimetrový vzdálenosti a já si pak změřím, kdo to skutečně dodržel. A teďka ještě... Uh, bude stačit tři z vás, vy tři, vemte si ještě jeden balon. A vemte si, uh, vemte si jiný než basketbalový. <coughs> tak. To samý, basketbalový balon, driblujete a s těma odlišnýma balonama si nahráváte. Ten balon nesmí spadnout. Když řeknu hra, tak se hraje ta hra. Žlutej! <coughs> Now you can see that uh, there can be some contacts. Uh, th there is a lot of focus on on the coordination because they have to control the ball dribbling, they have to control uh, the ball catching or, or throwing. A lot of cognitive things because they have to control the space, where the space is, how big space I can use, where my opponents are or my teammates, not to crash against themselves. Co je rychlejší? Co je rychlejší? Zrychlete to. Pojď, pojď, pojď. Chci vidět, že běháte co je rychlejší. Červený, červený. Co je rychlejší pojď? Co je co největší pojď? Co je rychlejší pojď? Co je rychlejší pojď? Co je rychlejší? Co je rychlejší? Hra! Uh, I told them that they have to they have to shoot they had to shoot from the distance of seven meters. Of course, uh, as well it's it's about um, uh, uh, space orientation as well to be able. Uh, to guess what what distance what distance is it so as well we are developing another another domain jutei tak jeden jeden běháme běháme až až řeknu hra budete zase do koše po každém koši Abyste mohli znovu, znovu střet na další koš, musí, musíte spadnout na žíněnku. Po, po každém koši, až vystřelíte, musíte spadnout někam na žíněnku a pak můžete střet na další koš. Hra! Hra, hra! Now I told them that... Uh, When they shoot a, a basket, so they, if they want to shoot another one first, they have to fall uh, on the mat. And I didn't stop the exercise. It means that they have they had to be focused on the exercise, what they what they what they had to do. But as well, they have to be able to hear my informations and to be able to capture them and then to apply them uh, to the exercise afterwards. So again, another uh, another things to uh, to focus on. OK, stop. <coughs> tak pojďte, pojďte sem. 
It's like a, a little bit warm up. I will show some exercises how to warm up as well to be to be well prepared for, uh, for for the contact as well. This kind of exercise is very important to to start with because we don't use only uh, the the physical domain. We want them to sweat, of course, but as well we have to wake up them. It's very important. I put a lot of things uh, like for coordination and gnost things it means like perception and decision making as well okay so it's a very important thing and I, th I think that they are quite well uh, waked up <coughs> so we uh, <coughs> okay. uh, uh, leader který bude dělat nějaký pohyb, jaký chce, jakýkoliv, basketbalový pohyb, jaký jste zvyklí, a ten druhý mu bude lehce dělat, jako mu bude v tom bránit, ale jenom lehce. Umožníte mu, aby ty všechny pohyby mohl udělat. Jo? Rozumíte? Tak to zkuste. So, now I, I, I told them to, 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 to embrace themselves, so we are getting into the theme of, of contact, not to be afraid of the contact. Obejměte se. Uh, they are asking how they can embrace themselves. It means that uh, the contact and wrestling, etc., it's not very um, familiar for them. Jakoliv se obejměte, jakoliv spolu jako zápasíte. And one of the player would be a leader, so he, 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 he will be doing a lot of like, um, um, movements as he wants, and the, the other one sh uh, should, should, uh, will try to, uh, to stop him, but only in, in light things, okay? So, so the leader should be able uh, to perform that movement all the time, okay? Because we are in the, uh, in the state of preparation uh, for the real activity. Tak, jenom, zkuste. Pomalu, 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 pomalu. Stop, 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 stop. Ty pomalu jsou, ty pohyby jsou pomalí, okay? Pomalí. The, the movements should be, uh, should be uh, uh, slow, because we are still in a kind of like dynamic stretching, we, could, we would say. Because like this we can, uh, we are using uh, the kind of movement and as well uh, using the, the muscles. It's not only like a static, uh, static uh, uh, stretching, like doing for example like this. But I can do the same thing, uh, inclining myself and the, 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 my, my teammate uh, can be like trying to stop me f uh, or preventing from that movement, but always uh, letting me to really to do it. Obejměte se pořádně, obejměte se, jako když zápasíte. Tak, dobře, stop, 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 obejměte se pořádně, pořádně tělo na tělo, chci vidět, že jste tělo na tělo, chci vidět, že jste tělo na tělo, tak. A, 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 pom, a pomalý pohyby. A můžete jít níž do vašeho basketu, jako když bráníte v basketu, že jo, to jste nějak takhle, tak dějte cokoliv. Šup. A obejměte se, tělo na tělo. A pomalu, pomalý pohyby. Pomalý pohyby. Tak. Dobrý, stop. Tak, teď se chytněte takhle, jeden takhle chytne ruce, druhého chytne za ty ruce a úplně to samý. Jo? Jeden je lídr, a druhý, druhý mu jenom jako znemožňuje ten pohyb, ale umožní mu ho. Jenom lehce. Tak jdem. Pomalu, pomalu, ty pohyby jsou pomalý. A v maximální, maximálním rozpětí, maximální šíři. Takže můžu se takhle natáčet někam, můžu jít takhle někam dolů, můžu jít nahoru, můžu strkat takhle k noze, cokoliv. Cokoliv si vymyslíte. A je to pomalu, je to pomalu. Je to skutečně takhle, jak dělám já třeba. Půjdu takhle dolů, nahoru. Pomalu a, a snažte se, aby ten pohyb byl v maximální možný šíři. Můžete se takhle otáčet. Tak, dvojice, do dvojice jeden balón. Tak, postavte se k sobě zády. A teď si, teď si ten balón budete, budete předávat. Nejdřív takhle jako kolem dokola, kolem těla, šup. Tak, jdem. 
maximální možný v míře se vytočte, ruce, ruce budou teďka pokrčený v loktech, ruce pokrčený, a druhou stranu, teď, teď ty lokty natáhněte, ve vejšce kolen, ve vejšce kolen si přidáváte balón, ve vejšce kolen, Tak tady, uh, now you can, you, you can see that the posture, uh, how they put the knees, how they put the, the back, a lot of them are like this, you know, so you can see that the, the back is not straight. A mezi nohama si to předáváte a přes hlavu, co nejníž, co nejníž nad zemí, co nejníž nad zemí a co nejvíš nad hlavou. Dobrý, každý si vemte balon, každý jeden balon. Tak, lehnout na zem a snažte se teďka eh, jako válet sudy a ten, a ten balon držte. Držte balon. Now they have to hold the ball and they have to like roll on the floor. So they have to control the ball and as well uh, as well getting prepared for, for the contact with the, with the floor. I can make it like more difficult. Uh, vemte si dva balony. Dva, ba, dva balony. Šup, co nejrychleji, ať má, ať, ne, nemusí každý jenom šup, dva balony. Tak, jeden držíte v ruce, druhý si dáte mezi nohy a zase se, a, a zase se válíte. Jeden mezi nohy, kamkoliv mezi nohy. A šup, a jdem. A válíme sudy. Co nejrychlejc, co nejrychlejc a kontroluju balón, kontroluju balón. And this is a kind of thing that we, we have to do uh, during a game. If there is a contact, so there is a contact. But still I have to control the ball. So I have to focus uh, on, on the ball. Dobrý, stop, vemte si ještě jeden balón. Když na každého nevyzbyde, tak, tak to nevadí. Tak. Jeden balón mezi nohy a dva balóny v ruce a to samý. And as well like uh, rolling on the floor with uh, two or three balls, So it's, uh, it's imitating a contact because the ball is getting here to my stomach or, or, or there or to my back or somewhere and, and the body uh, has to be like activated uh, uh, to be like uh, to not, re not, not relaxed because if it's relaxed so afterwards I can get injured. So what's, what's the, the, the main thing that after a contact I don't get, uh, I don't get injured? The main thing is that I expect the contact. So that's a very important thing. So if, if I don't expect the contact, so afterwards the injuries uh, are coming very soon. So, tak, jdem, sudy, válíme sudy, šup. <coughs> tak, dobrý. Vemte si jenom jeden balón, položte ho na zem a snažte se jakoby přes něj se převalovat. Ten balon, nesmíte, ne, ten balon nedržíte, ale válíte se jakoby přes něj. Já vám to ukážu. Doufám, že ten mikrofon nerozbiju, tady prostě se válí balon. A já prostě budu tady takhle různě se přes něj dostávat. Takhle bokem. Tam, tam má mikrofon. Zádama. Takhle. Jo. Jedem, šup. Now we are working on the, on, on the proprioceptive uh, system as well because I have to maintain the balance of the body as well. Okay, stop. Uh, four of you, čtyři si prosím vás vemte ty oranžový gymboli. Jestli někdo chce, může zkusit i ten, i ten tmavej, ale ten je vyfouklej. Šup, čtyři z vás, oranžový džimboli. 
Tak. Půjč mi ten balon. Tak. Teď můžeme vyskou... Teď uděláme to, že se vlastně postavíte na kolena všechny jako na, na kolena a teď se budete snažit se dostat jakoby docela relativně daleko. Budete do strany a zase do strany. Very important things, just look on their back. Kerem, šup. Kamkoliv, hrajte si s tím po všech stranách, na jedný ruce, můžete mít to pod, pod jednou rukou, po, takhle se opřete klidně pod jednou rukou, dostaňte ho takhle kolem, kolem těla, cokoliv. When the back is getting curved, so it means that it's too much for them. So don't go for that. Maybe you have to focus on in your trainings to uh, uh, to work on 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 the core. But uh, working on the core is uh, very important. Not to go uh, beyond the 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 capability of the players. Uh, present the capabilities of the players, because if uh, if you permit the players to do this exercise with the curves uh, uh, back like this. So they are able to do it, but they are learning uh, an incorrect uh, posture. And afterwards, it will, be, it will be difficult for them to even to move, because they will be moving with the, with the incorrect uh, uh, posture. Poslední věc ještě. Vemte si, to se zase dejte někomu jinému. Tak, můžu říkám ze několis, budete se snažit na ten balon se dostat, obejmě, obejměte ho nohama a rukama. Obe, oh, yeah. Tak, a teď se, teď se snažte eh, udělat vlastně jako, eh, jako sudy nebo různé kotrmelce a podobně, ale nesmíte pustit ten balon. A nahoru. Uh, the, I, I like very much this exercise because uh, as well the players they are getting familiar with the, with the floor and, and as well uh, naturally they are getting the right posture when they are falling because they have, to, uh, they have to be in the position as the ball is, rounded. So when, when I fall I have to be rounded as well. Okay, so, so this is like a, uh, an exercise uh, how to work on, on the technique of, uh, of falling as well. And, uh, and, and we are uh, working as well on, on a kind of um, strength, maybe, because they have to be able uh, to be always sticked uh, on the ball. We don't see that they, uh, they succeed a lot. Okay? Uh, Okay, we have how many times? So, můžu poprosit ty žíněnky, jestli hodíte takhle tady do strany. Tady takhle jsem, tady na tuhle polovinu. Tak, dobrý. A teď budu chtít jenom dva, dva z vás, dva s jedním balonem. Tak, vy si vemte balony a budete ke mně. Tak, budeme, budete hrát jeden na jednoho. Budete hrát tak dlouho, vypušte mi balon, tak. Budete hrát tak dlouho, dokovat neřeknu eh, Jim Ball. Když řeknu Jim Ball, tak balon necháte tam, kde je, ten na hraní. Budete muset jít na ten, na ten Jim Ball a budete se snažit si na něj kleknout. Jo? Když řeknu hra, tak se zase vracíte, musíte najít ten balon. Kdo první má balon, ten útočí. Jo? Tak hra. Tady je další balon, další balon, další, tady je balon, 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 šup. Dobrý, nech to bejt, šup. Hrajem, hrajem, hrajem. Tak, Jimball, Jimball. 
Kleknout. Vymyslete, jak chcete. Musíte si na to kleknout. Tak když, když vy uvidíte, že někdo už na tom dobře klečí, tak mu hodíte bol a on vám musí vrátit. Hra! Now you can see different, uh, as well, like the, the different focus uh, on, on the game and then proprioception. So they have to be always changing the focus. Jimbo! Tak, pojďte sem ještě tři. Tak, dobrý. Tak. Uh, nebo, no, dobrý, stop. Jeden, dva, tak, eh, dva. Takže ještě dva. Eh, dva modrý a dva, dva bílý. Tak. Dobrý, dobrý. Tak. Dva modrý, dva bílý. Čup. Co? Tak. Tak vy dva budete hrát spolu a vy dva budete hrát spolu. Jo? Tak. Hraje se s tímhle tím balonem, když řeknu, budete muset najít nějaký gymball někde v prostoru, udělat to, co máte, když řeknu hrát, tak se zase musí hrát. Musíte najít nějaký balon, nebo ten, ten hrací balon musíte najít. Ten, kdo první je u toho balonu, tak ta strana utočí. Hra. Hra, hrajte, hrajte. Jimbo! Co je rychlec? Kdo, kdo, kdo bude klečet první? Kdo bude klečet první? Bez rukou, bez rukou. Kdo chce balon? Kdo chce balon? Kdo chce balon? Kdo chce balon? Na náhrad byl zpátky. Kdo chce balon? Chceš balon? Hra! <těk> Dobrý. Stop. Tak. Tak, po, po, eh, pojďte teďka sem, udějte si eh, eh, čtveřice, ale tak, abyste byli vždycky dva, dvě barvy a dvě barvy. Jako třeba dva modrý, dva bílý. Tak, pojďte sem. Tohle teďka neplatí, jo? Tak. Tak, si tu jedno čtyřice. Tak, pojďte ke mně. Tady přede mě, tak. Podle toho, pojďte sem, když si klidně klikněte, podle toho, jaký vám dám balon, tak ten sport budete hrát. Co je za balon? Fotbal, co je tohle? Házená. Jo? No, to je taky házená. Jo, takže podle toho ten sport budete muset hrát. Jo? Tak, začneme, aby to bylo jednoduchý. Chytněte ho všichni čtyři. Tak. Tak, budete muset, až řeknu hra, tak se o ně začnete rvát. Někdo ho musí získat, někdo z vás. Kdo získá ten balon, tak bude dělat co? Bude útočit. A, a, a ta zbylá dvojice bude dělat co? Bude bránit. Takže chytněte ho oběma rukama. Až budete připraveni, jste připravený. Na zem, na zem, položte ten balon na zem. Hra! <těk> Dobrý, hrajem dál, hrajem dál, šup, hrajem dál. Šup, hrajem, hrajem. Další čtveřice, šup, další čtveřice. Dobrý, stop, tak. Tak tady chytněte balon, dejte mi ten balon. Kam myslíte, že hrajete fotbal? 
kde máte tam máte jednu branku, tam máte druhou branku. A ta, ta druhá branka tam nefunguje, že jo? Takže tam máte tamhle tu branku. Čiže tak chytněte. Ne, je tu velkou tamhle. Připravený? Hra. No, no, boju, 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 boju. To je ono, to je ono, no to je lepší. To je lepší. Boju, 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 boju. If, if, if I'm not using the legs and I'm only lying on the floor, I cannot, I, I cannot get the ball. Okay? A další čtveřice. Tak. A... OK. It's a, a žlutý, bílej, modrý, modrý. Každý jiný. Nevíte, kdo s kým hraje. Jo? Nevíte, kdo s kým hraje. Tak. Když řeknu hra, někdo získá ten balon, tak ukáže, tak ukáže na někoho, kdo bude můj spoluhráč. Jo? Takže já získám balon, ukážu na tebe a my hrajeme spolu. A utočíme. A vy dva tím pádem automaticky bráníte. Ale hra začíná, až když ty pochopíš, že se hraje se mnou. To znamená, že vedneš ruku. Jo? Připravený? Hra! Uh, this technique can be useful for you when, when you are battling for the ball on, on the ground. You, uh, you can see that one of the players, uh, he understood that it's very important to get closer to the ball like this. So, uh, like this, I'm, uh, I'm stronger. Uh, but he wasn't, he wasn't using his legs, so it's for nothing. And the other players, they were betting for, for, ball, uh, for the ball. Okay, so I'm very, very weak like this. Okay, so... So it's as, as well about uh, using your legs and as well to get, if I really want to, uh, to get the ball, uh, uh, so I have to get towards the ball, take it uh, into, uh, stick it uh, to my body, and then I can move somewhere. And if I'm not using my legs, uh, I, 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 I'm not able to get the ball, okay? And as well, I did a small modification in this exercise, so it means that the player who received the ball or who won the ball, so he had to decide with what player he would attack. So it means that uh, none of the players, they didn't know if, th if they were attackers or defenders. So uh, to switch uh, quickly, if, if I'm attacking or if I'm defending, to get oriented on, uh, uh, on the pitch, what's my role? Uh, I defend that space or that space. If I'm changing as well the sports, it, it means uh, football, in this case uh, football, handball or basketball. So as well, they, uh, there should be a communication between the players who will be defending the goal and who will be defending in the space, for example. And all of these uh, communications uh, should, be, uh, should be done during, uh, during the exercise. Very, very important and uh, very difficult things when they just finished battling for the ball. It's, it's very difficult to get orientated. So you, you could see that after a battle, they stood up and, and, and they, were like, uh, they were using a little bit of time to get orientated where I am, what I, sh what, what I should do. Okay? So it's exactly what we have to train. Okay? Uh, <clears throat> Something else as well. We have only one minute. Uh, můžu vás poprosit uh, tři žijenky, mi sem přijďte. <clears throat> tak. Tak dobrý, stop, 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 stop. já si někam, tady, tady, tady si někam takhle dám, dobrý, tak, ačkej, dobrý, tam, tam to nech, takhle. Takhle. Tak, eh, chci tři z vás, tři z vás.
Tak, ještě jedno. Tak. Jo, ještě, ještě jeden balon. Tak. Jeden se postaví takhle. Jo? Druhý takhle. Takhle k tomu. Třetí takhle. Jo? Až tu tady do prostředka. Tak, budete se chvilku jako, jako nějakým způsobem prát. Když řeknu hra, tak někomu z vás dám balon a zase vyberete si spoluhráče a ty zbylí dva e, budou bránit. Bude to tenhle balon, takže budete hrát, budete hrát baseball. Jo? Přijde na něj ukázat. No, jinak se ho nevybereš. Nebo nějak mu... Jo? Tak. Kdo je tady ve středu? Tak. Ty musíš tady... Ty musíš přijít k tomuhle hráči a odtlačit ho, co, co nejdál. Jo, a musíš se mu dostat jakoby pod, jako tady někam sem takhle. Jo? Tady ho musíš otlačit. Je to? Tak. Tady musíš udělat to, že ho musíš otočit, že ho takhle chytneš z vnějšku, takhle za nohu a musíš ho vlastně jako takhle otočit na záda. Jo? A ty půjdeš jako přes něj. A tady ho chytneš vlastně takhle. Takhle ho chytneš a vlastně já mám teďka ten mikrofon a budeš ho muset na sebe tak hodit a otočit to sem. Jo? A, když se, a, když, a když, jakmile se zvedneš, tak jdeš na další. Jo? Můžeš si vybírat co nejrychleji z každého, koho chceš. Jo? No trochu, no. Jo. Tak, jedem, hra. Jedem, jedem, rychlej, 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 rychlej. Za tělo, za tělo, za tělo, za tělo. Chytni ho za tělo. Šup, jedem, rychlej, rychlej, rychlej. Šup. Dobrý, ještě, ještě, je, šup, 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 je, je, no, rychlec. Dobrý, stop, 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 just, I will explain uh, something, you, you can see that the, 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 the boys, they are not using the, the body strength, they are using the strength of your arms or forearms, and it's, uh, it's, it's, it, the strength is very, very weak, you know. If I'm like, like this, and trying to move him, so I, I cannot succeed, because my arms are, are very weak. Just to move him. The one thing is, and and uh, as you can see, they are not used to to battle uh, between themselves or among themselves. So the thing is that uh, I have to get uh, uh, sticked to to his body. My legs, because the power is coming from the legs, so should be in a position they are able to uh, to move uh, somewhere. And I have to be stick to the body. I have to be stick uh, my uh, my head to his body as well. And and now I can do anything I want, okay? Even like this, okay? So I can and he he cannot defend himself, okay? And as well, my back should be straight, not not like that, for example. So a lot of times you can see that the players are doing this. So this is this is a, uh, the bad posture, a bad posture, okay? So this is the thing here. As well, trying to move him. So the the the, the thing is to get uh, uh, under his because there's a center of of the gravity. If I'm like this, so impossible for me. If I get uh, under him like this, so even I can catch uh, the arms so he can support his body to the ball, and then I can go like upward. <laughs> And he, can, he cannot defend anymore. And as well, while we are doing that, it's not battling for battling, but as well, to be in the right uh, position with the right posture. Straight leg, uh, straight back, and as well, the, move, the, the, the movement is coming from the legs. So it's not like this. It's not like that, for example, because you can see that if the strength, the, the power is going now towards uh, upward, but I want to move him towards there. So it means that uh, I have to compensate in my lower back. Very dangerous things. So not like this, but I have to get my uh, hip lower than my shoulders try and try to move him. Okay? So try it again. Ještě jednou. A ještě řeknu hra. Tak jo, ještě řeknu hra. Tak budete hra. 
A co nejrychlejc? Jedem, hra. And the thing is, that he gets a little bit uh, tired, and as well, the, the mental uh, activation is very high. Under him, pod něj, dostan se pod něj, šup, a znova, dalšího, dalšího. The mental activation is, is very high, and from that state, I would give him the ball, and he has to try to, uh, to put the basket. Hra! Hra! Okay, stop. So, here, yeah, I'm going to finish. So, uh, here you can finish, you can see that uh, after the battling, he, he was supposed uh, to choose as well uh, his teammate to attack. What, uh, what he was doing when he got the ball? He wasn't uh, deciding what, uh, what teammate I would, uh, he would choose, but he was putting himself into the space, so I am here, so I have to do what, ah, okay, and now, okay, so I have to choose, so now I will choose somebody, and, and who did he, uh, did he choose? Somebody who, were, who was the furthest from the basket. So somebody who, that between him and the basket were two players uh, to defend. What the defenders were doing? Maybe defending that player. But what's, what's my goal? If the defense is over there, I'm standing here, and even if I do a mistake and uh, I choose the, the furthest player to play with me, but my goal is to score. So if the defense is there, pff, I'm not waiting anything, and I'm going to the basket. But it's not that, that they are not enough clever. It's just that uh, it's, very, uh, it's very difficult uh, to alternate the, the, the high mental uh, uh, activation, low mental activation, concentration, and, uh, uh, and um, attention. Okay?